What's good? It is your boy, Bake. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I have a question for you. We're still dropping a contested video, by the way, later tonight. But do y'all feel that lockdown builds have been nerfed? With the new unpluckable buff, do y'all feel that we have been buffed? Let me know in the comments below after you spam up that lockdown game. Now, let's talk about it. This latest patch has, in my opinion, this is all my opinion, okay? Don't be mad at me. In my opinion, have made dribblers even more OP. Now they can spam. Now they can dribble with no consequences at all. See, we had something. When we had Hall of Fame unpluckable, we was able to get plucks. So you wasn't able to dribble at all like that. You had to be very strategic on how you dribbled. But now with this new buff, now with this new buff that 2K did to buff Unpluckable, it makes it damn near impossible to get a steal on smaller builds with anything in the gold or Hall of Fame. If you're in Hall of Fame, don't even reach. Don't even think about reaching for that basketball. If you don't go, you may get a pluck here or there, but it's non, it's just obsolete. But if you're on silver or bronze, you're able to get plucks just like regular, or for the most part, majority of the time. Anything below a silver, it's just don't even have a badge on. It don't even make sense. You're getting ripped all day. Now, by doing this, it literally has made us obsolete. It's made us not even relevant when we're playing guard builds. And the best thing you can do is try to mirror them and stay in front of them as best as possible. But ripping them is going to be damn near non-existent. And this is my issue with the patch because all it did was make one build more dominant than all the other builds when it comes to dribbling the basketball. And I know people are probably saying, yo, Bake, they're supposed to be like that. But Kevin Durant got unpluckable. He got high dribbling, low dribbling or so. And he's got unpluckable. A lot of other taller builds got unpluckable that you really can't reach like that. And it makes it where you have to make shorter builds if you don't want to get reached on, if you don't want to get spammed on. And so it, it, it it's like a double negative for lockdown builds, I should say. Because now, if you make anything taller that or anything that has unpluggable on silver and below, it's it's pointless. If you're trying to be a dribbler, you can't be a dribbler at all. Like my 6'7", I love him to death. But going out there with these smaller builds, it's in taller builds. It don't matter because a lot of people got unpluckable on Hall of Fame or gold. And I'm getting plucked left and right because I got unpluckable on silver. Or they got pickpocket, I should say, on Hall of Fame or gold. And I'm getting plucked left and right because I got unpluckable on silver. And it's rough out there. It's rough. And now, smaller guards, you can't even rip them. You literally can't. They just can dribble forever and ever and ever and ever and ever and ever. You get the point. You get my point. Smaller guards are even more OP than ever before. And I truly feel like this buff nerfed our builds. It nerfed lockdowns. Because lockdowns now can't get steals like that no more. Even when you time that thing, it's a foul. And I knew this was going to happen. Even when I asked for something to happen, I didn't ask for this to happen where now smaller dribblers are even more overpowered than ever before. They can dribble for hours. They can go left, right, left, right, left, right, left, right. They got the biggest speed boost where you can't react. They can stop on a dime, turn, go full speed again, stop on a dime, turn, go full speed again, stop on a dime, turn, they hit a three. No consequences. Because in the actuality, they're taking wide open shots. And so they made it where now you just got to help defense. But I got a solution that I'm working on, and I haven't mastered it yet. But I'm going to try a different technique. And I'm gonna, once I master it, I'm going to put it out for you guys to try to help us guard these little guards. And I think I got a concept that's going to work 
and it's going to be tough to, to, to master. But I'm going to try it tonight on stream. I'm going to start doing it even with no matter if you're a little guard or a big guard. I'm going to master this other technique. Y'all know we got the U technique. We got the right stick defense. We got the mirror technique, being able to stay in front of somebody as best as possible. But this new technique, I'm going to, I'm going to try to master it. I don't have a name for it, but I'm going to try to utilize it tonight on stream to help me guard little guys. And I'm going to put them and a disadvantage the best way I can. If this works, we got a chance. But right now, these smaller builds are overpowering. These are the new demigods, and we'll talk about that um, probably tomorrow, Friday. But the new demigods are smaller builds with unpluckable on gold, and if you got it on Hall of Fame, it's GG. They're 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 the new offensive. Demigods, not all around demigods, but offensive demigods. And if you make them right, you can make them all the way around if you put them with the certain attributes and certain things. But y'all let me know in the comments below. Do y'all think that this buff to unpluckable has nerfed lockdown builds? Let me know in the comments below. I would greatly like to hear y'all comments and y'all, y'all sort of point of view. Live life, trust, less you rock, and one of the best. Without God, my life would be a mess. Always remember to have faith, hope, and love. Take care of yourself. Stay true to yourself. And stay blessed. Peace.